We're gonna go one at a time. If you guys need to get your one on ones, get on this side, please. Media get out of chair right here for me. Media, get on this side. Congratulations, great fight. Talk to me about it. Uh, that was uh, pretty certainly a pretty entertaining fight. Uh, not for one on one. Yeah, okay. it was a good fight. I knew that he was gonna come in here and give me, you know, uh, a tough test, but uh, I had more. Talk to me a little bit. I think it was kind of in the early rounds. You, you kind of had you in a good bear hug from behind. You reached back and pounded him on the head like that. Hey, you know, uh, I love to fight, you know, no matter what you're going, man, I'm punching. Okay, so what, what what does this mean for you now moving forward? Yeah, yeah. You know, uh, this means that you know, I'm going to want to fight those kind of guys. Okay, What's, what do you think's next for you? You know, uh, I'm not sure what the future I hope, uh, I hope but, you know, uh, like I said, you know, now those, those top guys can't get money. Tell, uh, I mean, th this was not an easy fight. There's no question about that. You guys were both pretty impressive, I thought. You know, like I say, you know, I'm tw uh, I'm 21 and 0 now. He's a 25 and 1, but you know, he uh, you don't you don't get there just being anybody. Of course, you know, I knew he was gonna be tough. You know, you know, I knew. What is it that you take from this fight individually? What did you learn that you can use in the future? You know, I, I learned that you know I can hit the body. You know, earlier and uh, start faster and break my opponent down. And he was he was doing a lot of ducking and weaving in there, wasn't he? Yeah, you know he uh, you know, he's from South Africa. I knew that his uh, style wasn't going to be you know what I was used to. Well, well, tell me what you are used to. Yeah. You know, guys with you know, a little less movement, a little, a little less you know awkwardness, but you know that's how I got the experience. And, uh, I mean, you must feel pretty. Uh, uh, well, just tell me how you're feeling at this. You have to feel really good about how this is going. Yeah, you know, I, I feel good. You know, at the end of the day, I got the win, so you know, I can't be mad about that. And how do you like fighting in the ring? You know, the street fight was great. You know, and you can just show me love. You know, uh, I have to go out there. So, you know, uh, yeah, it's both good. Uh, I think the uh, crowd was getting into it a lot. They were making a lot of noise. I think most of them were pulling for you. Yeah, you know, like I said, Street Street Four came out for me. Um, I look forward to coming back. All right, thank you, Devin. We appreciate it. Congratulations. Thank you. All right. Is there a go, Dad? Yeah. 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 You know, of course, you know, I wanted to come out, use my jab. You know, I started out slow, you know, I, I knew that he was going to be, you know, kind of wild and kind of awkward, you know, so I started kind of slow just to see what he had, you know, had to. As the fight, you know, picked up. You know, I, I also, you know, picked up like, like I planned to. Talk about the power, man. I know you caught some power. You kind of showed him in the later rounds. You, you kind of hit him with some stuff. He responded. Uh, and he hung in there. Talk about some things that South Africans uh, kind of come out with. I, you know, I feel like you know, I showed power early. You know, I knocked him down in the second round. You know, with not even a hard shot. You know, it was just a short shot. I knocked him down. So, you know, I feel like you know, I showed some power. What are you most, what are you happiest with with your performance tonight? You know, I'm happy I got the win. You know, I want to thank God for that. You know, uh, of course, every time I know I step in there, you know, I want to win. Talk about being a contender, man. You talked about uh, letting people know and uh, putting you on the map. Uh, talk about being a contender and how you feel like you are right now. You know, it uh, feels good to be, you know, a contender, you know, that's just a label. You know, I still got to keep fighting and showing that, you know, I'm, I'm up there so those top guys and I can beat them. What are you going to do to celebrate a win like this? I want to hear the Tony Harrison run or what? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I'm, 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 I'm uh, you know, just rest, rest up, you know, and get prepared for, for my next fight. So what was your favorite strike or submission from tonight's fight? Say it again. What's your favorite strike or submission from tonight's yeah. fight? Submission. Like your moves. Just meet me out front. I mean submission when I put him in the head like I hit him. Nah, uh, shit. You know, I, I hit him with a, with a bunch of different combinations. You know, I got a really good tape. Yeah, keep up with him. Keep up with him. I was into it. So what is your next step after this nice one? You know, moving forward right, and, you know, right, uh, moving up in the ranks and fighting those top guys. Tell us to stay with you. Talk about some of the guys you're looking, looking forward to. Uh, anybody, anybody out there right now that you uh, got on your mind? All the champions. You know, I'm not saying no names, but, you know, it's a bunch of them. You know, you, you got to do your research. Do your research, but, you know, those top guys. What looks better, uh, your boxing style or church's shoes? <laughs> <laughs> that ass church stuff. <laughs> 
you Sean, love what question? I was asking which one looks better, his boxing style or your shoes? No matter. It's all around. You did. We call him Top Choice Rolls Royce in the gym. <laughs> but got it. You did take it to the body. Greatest fighter probably you will see in a long time. It's one of the bits. So we're going to continue to go forward and do this stuff. Hey, Mario. Captain Bates, all these yes, belts. Okay, okay. Last one. Last one, Sean. 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 Last one, Sean. Yeah. We're done. Thanks right. for your time. Sean, hey, Dad. Sean, come sit back. Okay, let's do it. All right, we appreciate your time. Right. Right. You ready to? Oh, David. Thank, Thank you. Right. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Did you get anything uh, like this? Uh, oh, yeah, I got enough. No, Thank you. Let's go, champ! Hey, hey! Feeling good, Dad? Appreciate you, Dad. Get this. I don't want to be awesome. Yeah, go get to the kitchen. Everybody can't. Oh, Sean's good. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah. Come on, Sean. 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 You, you can you can stay stay go meet me no, upstairs. No, no, no. So if you go go up there upstairs and meet me. Well, I'm coming off the elevator. Yeah. It's I'm in the elevator. Little winded after the I'm fight, man. You even need your rest. Yeah, man. Everybody get in the elevator. You can't breathe. Yeah, you know yeah. But yeah, of course you know I fought a tough fight, so you know you know need some space a little bit. How are you feeling physically? What did you say? Oh, I feel good. You know I barely got got touched. I don't know if I got, got hit with a head 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 I hit him with some uppercuts. Oh, oh I just knew he was going to be Just say you heard him. Yeah, you were telling me to go to the body. You kept telling me to go to the body. We, 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 we got the body. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, that body was killing him. You did go to the body, right? It was Man, that was wild. The wild. It's a fool, man. It's crazy. It was body. Yeah. Yeah. The hand shots were different. You remember? Yeah. Bang, bang. What about my man? What about my man? Man, what's up, Ray? Did you see how he was holding the lives? I was helping him. You had him going great. too, D. Let me get Once like he hit him in the head, but that man can come right back. The young boy got built. What's real? He got built. That's what it is. No rush, bro. This is hot. So, Darren just said, "Yeah, you got a lot of more cleaning to do now." <laughs> you did. Ooh, that was sick. I love oh, that. Don't do oh, oh, it. Do it again. Which one is it? The young boy got belts. What's in here, bro? Oh, this one the WB. The young boy got belts. You know what I'm saying? Belts. Happy with tonight, Bill? Huh? Happy with tonight? Absolutely. It's, you know what I mean? It's another step in his progression, like I always say. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. he's, he's on the job learning, you know? But. He's a 12-round fighter, not a 10-round fighter. And I keep telling the world, you know what I mean? So we got a, we're on a different kind of clock. Endo Jenny, uh, he, he, he's a, he the world, has a world title. He fought many times, 12 rounds. Burgos fought many times, 12 rounds. Menard fought many times. And we got him for 10 rounds. So clearly, we, you see that they're in trouble. You know what I'm saying? They're fighting for their life. You know, they're fighting to make the 10 rounds. You right. know what I mean? Right. So it'd be Not just, fighting to win, you think, at nah, a certain point? I mean, at, at, you know what I mean? But but it's good. It's, it, we're getting the rounds in, and, and I think when, when we go to this next level of champ, championship boxing, it, it will be a, a plus for Devin. Were you, were you kind of extra two rounds? Were you were you a little uh, heated at the ref? Did you feel like he was supposed to stop the fight at the end there? No, I mean, I mean, he was he was letting him hold too much. You know what I mean? We already had talked about. It. We knew that he was gonna hold, but I mean, he wasn't stern enough. You know, he, he warned him a couple times. He, he, he was pushing the Devin all over the over the ring. You know what I'm saying? But ultimately, ultimately, uh, those are the kind of shots that'll have you in the nursing home. The ones that Devin was hitting him, hitting him with. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, why would he stop the fight, man? Right. You know what I mean? Take this one. I need a, 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 I need
Man, you said the ref was terrible, Bill? Anywhere else, yeah. the ref is terrible. Yeah, yeah. you let him the do ref that. The ref is terrible. Who else supposed to say that? Well, I think, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Are you saying that because yeah. you, you feel like... Where else? Where else? Where else? Where else? Where else? Where else? The round the first knockdown, they scored it 10 nine. Did they? Yep, they didn't give him the extra point. Whoa! Crazy. Seymour told me. He showed it to me. But Will, are you saying that because, like you say, it's because you're worried about the other guy's health too, not just that you no, want the stoppage what, for death. No, no, right. That's the main thing. Right, it's the guy's health. You right. know what I mean? Right. That's the whole thing. Is you know, Devin is is, is a is a boxer puncher, and you know what I mean. An accumulation of shots from him, you know what I mean, aren't good. Let me get this to how you doing, man? Good to see you. I had to come, you know. Yeah. So, because everyone's gonna be there five years from now. So, you know, I gotta. Yeah. Get it in now. <laughs> and, and when you're there five years from now, we're going to take you first. That's the plan, right? Yeah. Definitely, because you get to show them love. Right. Well, it's when I saw him spar when he was 15, I said, he's going to be a world champion. Something more than that. How about when I saw him at seven? And when, in seventh grade, you said? When Dev was seven, he was sparring a 17 year old? When he was nine, he was about 89 pounds. They put him in with a 150 pounder. That was about 18 years old. He was holding his own. And, and wouldn't quit. The average kid say, I don't need this shit in my life. Dad, dad. He said, Dad. I want more. Bad boy. People think he can't take a punch, but what they really don't know is when he get in a real fight, that's when the real Devin Haney gonna show up. Mm. Cause you know that's when when a young fighter is checking all the boxes, that's that's the final question. What's he gonna do when when someone is good enough to actually land something? And that's so. when you're gonna see the real Devin Haney come out. You saw a little glimpse of it, mm -hmm. you know, he dug down deep. Real deep. He stuck his nose in there. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. He's showing the world what he made of. He ready to go. And, uh, I, I don't know. Lomachenko, uh, uh, 30 years old, want to fight a season 21 year old Devin Haney. I just don't see it. Right. I just don't see it. Right. I mean, you got too much talent. Head, foot speed, will, determined. See this crowd behind him tonight? Mm -hmm. He's not even from this town. They love him. Yeah, it's so good. And the tickets weren't that cheap either. It wasn't that cheap. Yeah, it was. <laughs> and the people showed up. Right. I mean, you know, it, it wasn't even like it was a world title fight. Right. You know? Right. But, but they came out for him. I mean, he's, he's the real deal. Let's see what he's talking about. <laughs> Thank you, man. Thank you.